Okay, starting across the street from Angel LG Santos Memorial Park, we're headed toward the intersection and then up the hill. This is San Ramon Hill. So we're walking past the Angel LG Santos Lati Memorial Park and on up the hill. On the right side is actually grounds of the governor's mansion. And you can see plenty of traffic. And here's a woman going walking backwards up the hill. And somebody coming down. And on your right, still the grounds of the Governor's Mansion. Or Guma y Tautau Guam. Just past the entrance. It's the entrance. We've been going uphill all this time. This is San Ramon. And we've got a park on our right now. This is... Most locals call this uh, Fort Apugan. I believe it's uh, Fort Soledad is the official name. And zipping along. And we just go into the park. And approaching the overlook and then spend a little bit of time at the Overlook. This is the Aganya Bay. Way in the distance you can see Two Lovers Point and Retidian Point is the furthest one you can see. The Aganya Bay is in the foreground with the Aganya as the uh, buildings in the foreground. Off we go. And then around the park, the parking level of the park, and you can see. Playground area for Navy housing. Gorgeous day. And heading back down the hill. Park on our left. Then here we are at Guma Itautau, Guam, and right there is the Guam Homeland Security Office with the entrance to the governor's house right here. And you can see the the mansion in the background there. Though it doesn't say that this is government house, but not totally true. Or at least that's not the way it's usually referred to here. Usually it's called the governor's mansion. And zip back down the hill. again. One line of cars. Let's 
the Bank of Guam building? Is that, no, I'm sorry, that's the DNA building. And into the Angel LG Santos Mo Ladi Memorial Park again. Through it. Zip, zip, zip. And out into traffic. Trying not to get killed. <laughs> 